Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. It is your girl K Nganyama. I am popularly known as K Yarm Starling. If you're new here, a very warm welcome to you. If you're a returning subscriber, welcome back to my channel, darling. Today I am going to be showing you how I installed this gorgeous unit. I will put all of the wig details in the description box so you can cop yourself one if you wanna. But yeah, otherwise, let's see how I did. I was actually very nervous to install this. Like the whole video went go away to be quite honest but i'm so glad that i just went ahead and did it and i think it looks pretty cute let me know what you think in the comments and yeah let's see there's nothing that irritates me more than like when this happens when your boobs sort of like pull down on your top over again that nothing else like as a pants so yeah i'm installing this braided wig which i got from my beautiful makeup artist Glam I'll put all the details in the bio We're installing this 13 by 6 braided wig I know, I feel the same I'm so nervous to install this and I was actually supposed to do this install like a long time ago but I've been so nervous because I just don't know like I don't know how it's going to turn out but this is what the closure looks like it's not an HD closure it is a transparent lace, it's not an HD lace, it's a transparent lace, but it's a 13, it's a full frontal 13 by 6, and then at the back it's got yeah, well, this wig cap. So, I was contemplating whether or not to do this video for TikTok or Instagram, but TikTok ain't paying me, child. I'm so bothered about why we south africans africans don't get paid on tiktok especially because we know that other people americans are getting paid so it's to create a mahala no that doesn't sit right with me son but yeah hey she's all gone this is what this wig looks like sana i'm so scared you know what i'm gonna do i'm trying to figure out if i should wear a wig cap or not i'm gonna tint this using um my born this way foundation i'm just gonna like very lightly tint this because you know what they say about foundation and the glue but yeah i'm gonna do it on the back yeah crayon basically just to make this um less more blend in more with my skin if that's fine oh she looks good And I really don't know whether I should cut the lace first. <laughs> whether I should cut the lace first or let me see what that looks like on my phone actually. I don't know, I really feel like the normal mirror does nothing for me. I have to see what it looks like. <laughs> I have to see what it looks like on the phone. Oh she looks good! First of all, placement. Where will I place this wig? Is here a good place? Oh you know why I'm also nervous. I actually haven't installed a wig in so long. You know what I'm going to do? Mm. I'm just going to go ahead and do it. No, I should not have taken it off because you need to it. It's just a wig. Honestly, it will work out. And even if it doesn't, who cares? We'll try again tomorrow, okay? I'm going with some rubbing alcohol. Also, the discoloration is looking quite good. That's on Nivea Luminous, period. My skin tone is so even. I'm gonna go with my bold hold glue. I guess no original we fake in got the game away one original channel more. I'm doing it. I am doing it. I am doing it. I wish it was an HD lace, but I can't possibly imagine the heaviness of braids. To be quite honest, this wig is not as heavy as I thought it would be. Like, because I mean I expect braided wigs to be like really really heavy. But it's not that heavy, Shim. Oh, you know what I should have done? I should have cut the ear tabs. Thought I wish it was an HD lace so it's easier to like blend. I don't own a single transparent lace wig, Shim. And I'm so proud to say that because I feel like transparent laces aren't for dark skin girls, Shim. Transparent lace wig is a wig for a light skin girly and 
you know what i feel like the sooner we begin to like accept that the better like it is for everyone it's unfortunate reality that we live in I, let's blame it on colorism guys because i don't know why we dogs and girlies have to pay like more for a good blend <laughs> blending a transparent wig is a nightmare okay the first layer of glue is doing really well it's drying really well very quickly I find that using my finger to do this just allows it to blend better and it dries faster. I don't know if it's the warmth that my finger or the fact that I can kind of like get it smoothed out like better on this, but I don't know. I think this is clear enough. Hey, you can say that and then it will shock you. We are doing this thing. But I feel like this is a good enough, a decent placement. Yeah, this looks decent, right? You know what, now that I've like got the wig on my head, I don't feel so nervous. for a few minutes I'm gonna switch on my hair dryer at this point yeah I feel like there is not enough pressure pulling on this wig and this pressure is usually found at the back of the wig oh shit it's because this is not I'm so annoyed it's because it's not tied and that's what usually like causes these little rifts learn if you feel like you can't get rid of them just tie your elastic stronger or instead of like hooking it, it's just we will be fine. It might give you a headache, but hey, Sana, sometimes that's just the price that you have to pay for beauty, you know. Like, Le, it's not gonna give me flat if I don't tie it. Or rather, I think <laughs> what's safer is to use a bobby pin because when you tie it, because when the headache is like unbearable. You want nothing more, nothing, nothing to do with that little knot you tied. And that's happened to me. I'm like definitely speaking from experience. What I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna pin this hair back. Hang and It's giving. I just can't believe this is a thing. <laughs> I'm gonna show my mom and mom's and say hi. Hi, Bo. What's up, Mom? Hey. 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 I will always in the Namatel King for Tangela was always in the Luna who said to an eye to be Namatel was in. I then was in the Luna Matisella, lots of lips on the man before you clung gay. Nanfuna the old wise cone, the Panaja name with the Panaja and the wicked in dad. I lay Namatisella when Funa Lingan and Eclosing Nana Pabil. I write got a eyes by it and Jengade because Lena Eclay Ubuki by Ubuti. It's like Ulugil, Ebo. Yeah, yeah, I 
I feel like am I tripping? I feel like this side is more further down than this side. You can't even see if you laid the wig properly because of this baby here. I really don't think it's bad and I keep saying I don't think it's bad because of the stigma around braided wigs people are like oh, bring me your wig bring your wig nah me I used to be that person actually braided wig braided wig oh Kim Mortenje thanks for that let me my friend okay so this is how we're looking I think I'm just gonna put this band on and try and because I don't have glamour spray I'm just gonna go in with this um, other ultra the hairspray that I have and I'm just gonna level tap it and do like that and this should further like secure my hair I'm gonna dry it <laughs> Yeah, this is times two. I don't have time to play around with these melting bands then because they just don't come strong. So what am I to do? Okay, honestly, this is giving me a headache and I'm about to pass out. And oh, oh shit. Damn. Okay, though. Okay, stink. She laid or whatever, period. Oh lord, why are they coming out? I think I cut them. Oh, son, along. Hey, son. don't know what to do with these baby hairs I think first things first I need to cut them I'm nervous. I am genuinely nervous. I don't know what to do. What's the alternative? So yeah, I don't think I want the dramatic baby hairs. I mean, I don't think I could because of how my hair is set up already. But I think I'm just gonna add some moisture. I'm gonna give it a shot with the straightener if I burn my fingers. At least I would have given it a shot.
but you know what nonetheless I'm gonna get off cam and hopefully by the time I am done with my makeup we will have the final results and hopefully by the time I'm done with my makeup we'll have the final result I really love how it turned out. Ah, it's in my clothes, I'm fine. It's giving expensive skin period. I really love this hair. And this is how I've decided to style it with just two clips at the back. This is kind of like my signature style though. I feel like this is how I always would style a wig. Let's see what you guys. I was very nervous about this. And I'm so happy that I just kind of like went ahead and did it, you know. I was nervous. And I think it's pretty cute. So yeah. I feel like nibbling it's a yeah. So yeah, so yeah, so yeah, so yeah. But anyway, yeah. Um this is the way guys. Um yeah. Thank you so much for watching this tutorial. If you did like this video, give it a huge thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, leave me a comment in the comment section down below. Thank you. Bye.